Hey guys, and welcome to some more Star Citizen. Today I'm just going to talk very briefly about making your own user.cfg files, getting some maybe better performance or quality out of Star Citizen. User CFG files can edit a massive amount of settings to improve your Star Citizen experience. And making your own user.cfg is incredibly easy. You literally just need to make a file in Notepad and save it as user.cfg after putting any settings in that you require. There is an extensive list of settings, which I will keep updated, linked in the description, as well as pre-made settings, pre-made user.cfg files for people that want either the best possible performance on low-powered PCs, or ones for super high quality on beastie PCs. The user.cfg needs to be put in different places based on whether you're playing on PTU or live servers. For PTU or test servers, um, put it in your install folder, Cloud Imperium Games, Star Citizen test, just it lives in there. For the live servers, put it in Cloud Imperium Games, Star Citizen public lives in there for the live servers. Making your own user.cfg files is the best option. You only need to include the settings that you want as well. You don't need to put all the settings in there and just put them in literally the settings that you want. And there are settings for multi GPU users as well as CPU threading options for users that want to experiment with those particular settings. They are really great, they are really powerful, but they can cause issues. And note in general that user.cfgs can cause different issues and bugs themselves. So bear that in mind. If you're having a persistent bug, try deleting your user.cfg first before reporting it as a bug on the issue council. Linked in the description is a full user.cfg guide in text form, literally going through all of the settings, explaining what they do, how they work, and how to put them into your user.cfg. Please check that out. This is essential for this guide. It's literally, this is a companion video for that text guide. There's a couple of other little tips I can recommend for some extra performance for all users. Close that Star Citizen launcher once you've launched the game. That little program can eat resources. Uh, a couple of IO bit programs that I use that really increase my performance in general, or at least stability, uh, or at least help me, are uh, a driver booster. So this program searches and updates loads of drivers across your system that Windows updates and you might not necessarily be installing yourself. Uh, and also there's a program called Advanced System Care. There's a turbo boost function on that that can really help older PCs or PCs with limited RAM um, free up some resources to get a bit more gameplay frame speed out of their out of their game. Anyway guys thank you very much for watching. You can support us on Patreon now too if you're that way inclined but please don't forget to like and subscribe it really does help me and I'll see you in the verse.